हेलो फ्रेंड वेलकम बैक दिस इज संजय कुमार फाउंडर ऑफ सेलेक्टर्स ऑफ इफ यू आर न्यू हेयर प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल टू गेट ऑल द अपकमिंग अपडेट्स थैंक यू सो यू नो दैट वी कैन ऑटो जनरेट द कोड फ्रॉम सेलेक्टर्स ऑफ नॉट जस्ट द एक्स पाथ लाइक इफ यू हैव टू गेट द एक्स पाथ एंड यू वॉन्ट दैट विद द कमांड सो यू कैन गेट दैट सो लेट मी शो यू वॉट यू कैन डू इट टूडे सो इफ यू इंस्पेक्ट एनी एलिमेंट राइट देर यू कैन गेट द एक्स पाथ so generally like what we do we copy this x path go back to our editor and here we have to type this command right either this command or whatever command you used on x path because directly x path we doesn't use so we always write some command so this is my command in my framework so i have to type this but you know that you can get this command in selectors hub like you can just turn on here and you can paste this command and uh, like wherever you have written x path that you can replace with x path value keyword so this could be done and you can copy and paste this great feature but here there this was the thing that many a times lots of people were not aware that how to set this command here and how can they add this command though there was like uh, instructions were there but still a little bit of effort was required here so because of that uh, we were wasting some time and effort as well so uh, lots of people ask and in fact like recently mukesh otwani my friend he told me he also suggest that sanjay can we have this uh, feature that automatically it should come here these values it should suggest so that like we can save our time more and it automatically generate the code it doesn't require that we have to type then set command because not lots of people doesn't know that how they can set the command here and uh, where to replace x path and what to do so for that region earlier i have planned this feature for 5.0 selectors of 5.0 but then i thought like why to uh, wait for this one and let's release this feature and let everyone enjoy this and save their time so here this feature is i will show you and uh, one more thing like earlier uh, here there were like one a smart feature was there in uh, like you can record the command and uh, like where you can record multiple selectors there was a feature that you can uh, like if you have a command like this uh, to generate the locator page so here you could you were we were able to set this command and here uh, like we replace this x path with x path value keyword and now when we start inspecting the elements here the this used to generate the complete command that like this command and it used to have this uh, selector name as well like here so this was a good thing but now you will see that here uh, but this feature this selector name sorry here it should be selector name so it used to generate this complete command like for a locator page so but the good thing is this that uh, now it will be available in the default like for one selector as well this command thing earlier it was not there like you we were not able to generate this locator page command so let me show you how all these features has been integrated now and how all this process has become easy so this is the new feature now i'm going to show with the latest version and this feature will be available from 4.3 onwards so you need not to do anything if you haven't updated yet to the latest version 4.3 point uh, current version in production is 4.3.1 so please add that update in your browser update selectors so are basically in your browser so now you will see that let me take this practice page i would highly recommend guys if you want to learn explore more things please do check out this practice page this will help you a lot so yeah let me zoom in so now you will see that how fast and easy and crazy it is going to be like let's say inspect any element suppose we inspect this enter your email field so right now i can copy this field copy value go back to editor and paste that uh, and type that command or we can set that command here but now as soon as you turn on this by default the command one command is already here and you see that it is generating with this and you can now simply copy and paste in your editor okay good but this is not the command let's say you doesn't use this kind of command you are using something like locator page like this kind of command so can i get this kind of command as well in selectors up yes you can get this now 
you need not to type you need not to worry how to set this command and all you just click here and you see you got the auto drop down here and where like mostly used by like almost 90 percent people are being using these commands so i have already done a lot of surveys where i found people are either using this command or this command and cypress people are using this command so it is very easy now you just select this and hit enter and see the magic your uh, locator page command is ready here like at find by x path is equal to this at cache lookup private web element and the element name because for every element we used to give the reference right so this you got it now you can copy and go back to your editor and this you see here you can paste it here and uh, like of course you can rearrange as you want so this way it will be very easy and faster for you to uh, get the command to get the locator page and if you want to change anything in this command of course you can do that like let's say you want to add semicolon now you hit enter and uh, here it will be adding that update it will update that so that you can copy suppose this is not your command like let's say your command is something uh not this whole thing you just want this one so you can add it and update and next time yes this command will be saved in selector sub so you need not to set that command again and again when you will open next time it will open with your command now you inspect any element here it will be giving you with that thing so this is going to be very easy and very quick faster this will save a crazy amount of time for you guys if you want to auto generate multiple selectors for multiple selectors and you want to generate code for multiple command uh, multiple elements you just turn on this and here you go you just inspect the elements and you will see the magic here in selector sub all the commands are getting ready you just have to copy and paste you click on copy all go back to your editor and paste them so it will be very fast to write the automation script now and uh, getting the code from the selectors hub and whenever you want to change anything any particular command you can take that and select copy and paste it so easy it is to auto generate the locator space for your uh, framework and if you are using cypress you just click on here cy.get and hit enter you got all the cypress command here and paste it so this is very easy and smooth it is going to be and very fast and of course the locators which selector sub generate so as you guys already know that they are the best selectors so you can of course trust on those selectors you can directly use it in your script and you need not to waste any more time to like uh, writing these command again and again or setting that command again and again selector sub this is very simple just click on this button and here choose whichever command you are using in your framework hit enter and this will be auto generated you can uh, all other configuration and everything a lot of feature are there in selector sub so i would highly recommend you guys that do check out the detailed tutorial of selector sub the link i will leave in the description so please check out all these features they are really crazy once you will be like uh, once you will explore them you will be able to save a huge huge amount of time so i hope you like this feature do let me know in the comment section if any command you are using in your framework along with the x path and you want that command here or by default let me know in the comment section i will add that command so that it will be easy for your framework to select and generate the code and if that is not there currently here you can of course type and change this command here and set that so i hope you like this feature please let me know uh, how much it is helping and what all other features you want in selector sub with that thank you thank you so much please like the video and share with others this will help them a lot to save their precious time thank you thank you so much for watching